Hey there everybody, I'm Brooks here with another mock and this was actually uh, from my mock city. It is the first um, completely enclosed building I have ever done. It is a toy store, if you can't read the sign. Toy, so it has a witch's hat, a little nutcracker build right there, a bulldozer, uh, a, a toy, probably not a real, um, what are those called again? Shuriken? No, yeah, shurikens I think. And um, then a little drone held up by some... Uh, a metal pole it used to just be a lot of one by twos but then i changed that out and here's the back in case you were wondering and toys is brick built uh you can see the red and blue uh striped uh design all around it that's mainly because i didn't have completely blue or completely red pieces though i like how it turned out um if you didn't notice the hinges there are hinges and it's only accessible when you take this off um so hard to get in there but uh, you also have to remove this piece and this piece and then hinges right open and yep there's a lot to look at so I don't want to hinge it all the way so here how about first we do this where you can see the whole interior so that's how it all works out together and you know I'll show that again after I explain more of the uh, interior in the store whole sort of uh, open feel so uh, you come in through this yellow door nice right there. It really brings it um, a nice feel and it uses like um, two of those pink half lights from uh, friends uh, Two more of those drones you saw one in red one in uh, Blue and obviously black as their base colors. We got two paint brushes right there and um, Represented paper just a lot of two by two tiles right there. No like two by two um, sorry, uh, no two by two plates behind those. Those are all just tiles, so they can all be taken out. Um, I got uh, two more builds: a bulldozer and a train, very reminiscent of like the free uh, little uh, elf um, promo thing for if you said one hundred twenty-five dollars on Lego.com around the time they did the castle thing, which I reviewed. However, the elf thing belonged to my sister, and she took it apart. Uh, so I do hope to make a Lego Lego store for my uh, city, but until then. This will have to do because all two stores do have some Lego. I got a wood by two printed Lego um, set right there. And then just a bunch of bricks and little uh, cats for pick a brick. And we got a cameo. It's Jang. I do have to replace his arm, but he's wearing a kind of suit, a mustache. And what makes him Jang is really take all that off his face print right there, which is the same for Jang's uh, Sig Fig. I think I have that mustache the wrong way, but. I'll fix that later, but yeah, he's could get Lego, obviously. Um, anyway, along this side, uh, I made this before the Lego Ninja movie came out, so I figured that they'd have like really promoting it. So you got um, a bunch of uh, swords and those longer swords and um, Lloyd's mask, a bunch of shirt canes or throwing stars inside that barrel, and a training dummy with a headpiece. And then yeah, you could see the simple build of that and. That is an official Lego sticker from the Lego Ninjago um, sticker book of Garmadon. Here we have uh, action figures, so a bunch of micro figs, all from Lego Ninjago City. Yes, that is so perfect. And then some of these from like the board game. And then here is the checkout slash gift wrapping place. There are the colors that they'll wrap your gifts in. I like the uh, table kind of build. Uh, you got a gift box under there. Can you see that right there? and a gift box on the table. And in the back, you have Batman's helmet and Jagger one and a Star Wars one. So uh, that is it for pre uh, pretty much the inside. And that is how the whole thing kind of looks um, really just closed off, uh, how they work together. And then you can, it's really simple just to lock it in two ways. First, put those uh, plates right there. And I made them different, not just regular tiles. Uh, sort of like grading so that you know exactly which ones to take off and then you can go ahead and put the roof back on and I'm gonna attempt to carry this in one hand and carry my toy store in the other hand That's its place in the city right next to the clothes store and Yeah, you can see I have a lot of tiling and plates. That's um, By design so that I could easily remove this but I need two hands to really place it down and That's where it lives in my city. Yep. Uh so yeah, I hope you liked this video and this look of the toy store. Please subscribe, leave a comment down below, and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye for now.